the basics of storefront framing. Welcome to Building Knowledge 101. In this video, we outline the basics of storefront framing systems, including their suitability for low-rise applications and structural constraints. Storefront is restricted to low-rise applications. As you get higher on a building, the wind loads increase. A typical storefront is designed to provide 8 to 10 pounds of water performance and a maximum design load around 40 PSF. Typically, it's suggested not to be used over about the fourth floor in a building. Storefront systems are intended for single span applications only. They do not have the accessories required for twin span. Verticals are anchored just at the head and the sill. Mullions must be sized in advance to support the anticipated lo wind load at each project. Storefronts are set within the structure of the building behind the exterior plane of the surround. Storefront systems are secured to the rough opening via fasteners that run through the perimeter of the frames into the surround condition. They need to have sufficient structure around the perimeter of the frames to which they can be shimmed and secured. Storefront systems are typically four and a half inches or six inches deep, so they are limited as far as wind load and dead load capacity. Typical vertical spacing is going to be around four and a half feet, maybe five feet at the most. The size of the glass and the spacing of the verticals is going to be limited to the structural capability of the frames. Moving the verticals further apart makes the insulated glass units wider, increasing the dead load on the horizontals, potentially adding more dead load than the horizontals can support. This would also increase the tributary area that each vertical must support, potentially overpowering the elevation. A major difference between storefront and curtain wall is the way each handles water that enters the system. Storefront systems drain water down the vertical members to the sill where it moves forward and out. On tall, narrow window elevations like you see here, wind load and dead load are not limiting factors, but because of how the system weeps, if you tried to use storefront here, you could overload the system with water leading to a leak to the interior. That is all we have time for in this video. If you'd like to watch more of our 101 video series, subscribe to our YouTube channel, Conair Company, Inc.